Hi, Namaste everyone. Hope everybody is doing awesome. So today I'm going to talk about a very important yet a very common topic uh, that influences our life each and every day. They're called habits. So habits are something which we do on an ongoing basis and every uh, moment of life we make choices and we develop a habit according to our choices and it's said that we are our life is a manifestation or habits only so um, and if we are developing a habit to work towards ourselves or have some kind of practices in our life it's very important to choose a good habit versus a bad habit so um, let's take an example of going to bed on time suppose I have decided that I'd go to bed not after 10 p.m. but I'll go at 10 p.m. only so but at the same time I feel like surfing my social media so what should I do so whenever um, a habit is developed whether it's about any decision we take in life so it goes through three faculties of our mind first it goes through a mind which is a thought arises in a mind that I want to go to sleep but I want to surf a social media then it passes through another faculty of mind which is called intellect so there's a dialogue or the words go inside our intellect a very important faculty of our intellect is discrimination which helps us choose what is good for us and what is bad for us so after that dialogue happens between the intellect whether i want to go to sleep or i want to go on and surf the internet then a decision comes out and then the action happens so if I do a particular task, suppose I decide I'm going to surf my social media for half an hour and if I do it over and over again, that develops into a habit. Then what happens that the middle faculty of intellect doesn't work at all. So from the moment a thought arises, it transmits directly into the action without the dialogue going in between my intellect, whether it's good for me or bad for me, because now I don't even listen to my intellect. As soon as a thought arises, that impulse urge happens to go to the social media I go it without even thinking about it that's what happens and we start living in an automated mode and more we engage in such negative behavior or behavior which is not good for us it doesn't stay there why it's dangerous because a half an hour can become two hours or two and a half hours and then we lose the sleep time and also not follow a good pattern of routine so what do we do to develop a good habit so we have to have that intellect come into play all the time and how to so that we can discriminate what is good and bad and how do we foster our intellect by talking to ourselves, sitting with ourselves, analyzing our thoughts in the seat of meditation so sitting with ourselves is very very important to analyze whatever is going in in mind and over a period of time when you do that the clutter from the mind clears and you get a clear direction which direction you want your life to go in and it's easier to develop a good habit at that point if you're not sitting and analyzing your thoughts and the dialogue between your intellect is not going whether to choose this or that then that cannot happen it's very difficult to all of a sudden get up one day and just follow really good habits or pattern of life so um, if you are in the path of changing any of your habit or you feel like you need to change that to achieve a better outcome I'm always here to help you and guide you so let me know because my next video will be on meditation but before that we have to um, just spend some time in analyzing like what habits do I have and do I need to change something even eating eating is a very big um, big part of the habit so anything that comes to your mind you can share here or uh, text me directly thank you so much and namaste